Hey everybody, and welcome to me playing Dark Souls. <clears throat> Excuse me. I've talked about Dark Souls and that series for an insane amount of time, and I've never actually just played it. So I decided to do, like, play it in a Let's Play format or anything like that. So I decided, you know what, let's go through Dark Souls 1, 2, and 3 if I can, and try to 100% all the bosses. Not 100% the game, but try to, you know, beat all the bosses, optional or not. So, uh, let's just have some fun. Uh, I'm gonna skip some story stuff, because, uh, I'm only doing 15 minutes an episode, and I really don't want cutscenes to completely overrun the Let's Play. But, uh, I'm an undead zombie, and, uh, legend tells that one yes, of us, indeed. me, yeah, I know, uh, me, this guy, who, uh, oddly enough, when he looks human, kind of looks like, uh, Ryan Reynolds, but whatever. Uh, but, uh, I have to escape this asylum, and then I have to, uh, ring some bells and sacrifice myself to, uh, make sure the world doesn't go dark. So, here we go. Going through the asylum. And you're dead. I missed. I totally missed. I am a pyromancer. Just it just seems right. And my uh, gift is a key. They'll unlock a lot of doors. You know, I've played this remaster a few times and just never realized that that stray demon is right there. Just never realized it. Heard it. Just never looked over there. So I'm a huge fan of Dark Souls, obviously, uh, and I've tried to play Bloodborne, Sekiro, and Demon Souls in stream format or Let's Play format, and I just never did like finished it. I really want to actually finish this one. So, and this this isn't going to be like a big like comedy thing, and it's not going to be a big lore thing, and I'm, you know, I'm just playing the game, uh, just for fun. For the people that, you know, might be interested in it, but, uh, may think it's just too hard. Which is understandable. Dark Souls is a very unforgiving game. So let's meet our first boss. First of many. The Asylum Demon. Boss fight over. <laughs> no. Uh, I mean, you, you can beat him if you have, like, black fire bombs, or if you're really patient and you beat him with this, you know, broken sword. But, uh... Yeah, just not, not gonna deal with that right now. Alright. I just got a shield. Stab this guy, but only do six damage. All right, so now I have my hand axe. I now have shield. I don't quite have my uh, flame hand yet. I think I get that up here somewhere. Let this boulder come down. Ow! I can't believe I let it hit me. <clears throat> oh, you. You're no hollow. Thank goodness. I'm done for, I'm afraid. I'll die soon, then lose my sanity. I wish to ask something of you. You and I, we're both undead. Hear me out, will you? Regrettably, I have failed in my mission. But perhaps you can keep the torch lit. There is an old saying in my thou who art undone uh -huh. when thou will not uh -huh. go. Uh-huh. Uh -huh. What I just said. One of us undead has to go to the land of ancient lords, ring the bell of awakening, and uh rekindle the first flame. I might go into more story later on. 
But if you want to know the full story, there's like YouTube videos and things like that. They'll explain it a lot more. The, the story of Dark Souls is a lot deeper than just like... Go, you have to go here and do this thing. There's like pages and pages of lore. And if anything is like really significant, I will... Uh, I'll, I'll talk about it. Yeah, there's like a curse and like anybody that is cursed with it can't die so they become undead warriors and all of them are sent here to this asylum so yeah that's what i'm doing here all right all right let's try to fight the uh asylum demon now that i have a weapon oh before i forget go ahead and get that yeah i love doing this die so got a ton of his health. Okay, so... Ow. Nope, 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 nope. Alright. He's weak to fire. Wrong button! Is that first boss down? Okay, I still hear the stray demon walking nearby. Stray demon and asylum demon are essentially the same thing. I mean, they're two different bosses, but they're the same thing. Uh, but I don't fight the stray demon yet. Uh, spoiler alert I can come back here later in the game, but not right now. Ancient legends, it is stated that one day an undead shall be chosen. To leave the undead asylum in pilgrimage to the land of the ancient lords. Lordran. Here we are at Firelink. Firelink Shrine is like the uh, center of the of the game. You can pretty much, like there's, you can go that way and go to one area. Uh, eventually you can go that way and go to an area. You can go that way and go to a completely different area. You can go down these steps over here and go somewhere else. We're not gonna do any of that. Instead we're gonna rest here uh, so that we keep respawning there. I mean, I think either way I would keep respawning there. Uh, I'm not gonna talk to this guy. This guy, I don't care. He's kind of a douche, and he's just gonna tell me exactly what I've been told twice. Oh, you're here to bring the bells of awakening. This dude sucks, but uh, I'm gonna talk to him anyway. Come on. Got a coin, and very well. That is a shame. Speak. Okay, I'm not gonna be in his covenant, whatever. Uh, oh, there's a thing up here, I think. Hear those bells. Yeah, I think there's an item. There is... Soul of Lost and Dead. So, uh, I'll keep gathering these souls. Uh, first off, souls you get from defe defeating enemies. You'll see that number on the bottom right. Uh, but... Uh, like you get these like soul things uh, like I just got soul of lost undead or something uh, if I consume those it just 
gives me souls. So, and souls are what you use to uh, level up your character, buy items. And uh, if you die, you drop them on the ground. And if you die again before picking them up, they go away forever. So. Oh, I didn't get whatever he had. Oh well, probably wasn't important. But the reason I'm just kind of like tearing through this is I've played Dark Souls. I think this is like maybe my fourth playthrough. So I kind of already know what's going on. There's like things I could do. Like there's hmm. So you go ahead and do it. Why not? What have I got to lose other than like 2,000 souls? In a little bit of time. So there's a speed run strat. Uh, sort of. Uh, so I mentioned that I got the uh, so I got this master key. It opens any basic lock. So this means I can actually go to a certain area super early in the game. Uh, I can actually bypass a lot of the game because of it, but I'm not going to. What I'm going to do, I'm going to uh, get some items. So we'll take this elevator down, and this is going down to an area that I'm not going to go to until like the end of the game. Uh, I mean, you can go through it, but it, it's, yeah, it's not recommended. But uh, I, instead of going there, you can see that all that over there. I'm going this way. Oh, free souls. I don't know why I kicked him. It only gives you 20. Whatever. 20 is 20. I missed like three times. Also, you're going to see me like try and fail to parry. I'm going to do my best to parry well. All right. See, I use the master key. So now, the entrance to Blight Town, which is an area that you go to a little bit later, is right through there. So I can bypass a lot of the game to go there. I'm not going there either. Instead, I'm going this way. There's some items I want. There's a ring I want, there's a sword I want, and there's a shield I want. Um... So this guy, he's not going to get up unless I aggro him or pick up these items. So let's pick up these items really quickly. Deck coming. That's okay. I got the I got the sword and I got the shield. I can get the ring at a later time. Uh, it's not important. I did lose two thousand souls, but uh, yeah, I can go back and get them. How much time do I got? I don't, yeah, I got plenty of time. I'm gonna try to do like 15 to 20 minutes per episode, so if I go a little long, it's gonna be okay. I'll just have to edit out any BS. Like this, probably. I'm probably gonna edit this part out. back to where we were and my soul should be down here by this stupid dragon he's kind of already looking for me where are they there. oh stop here we go I need to go back, but uh, I'm greedy, so I'm gonna try my best. Do I have? 
I do not. I thought I had a homeward bone and maybe I could just like warp back, but nope. Oh, and these guys suck. I'm just gonna bypass them for now. And I'm gonna go. Yeah, this area is uh, a late game area, and I'm here super early because I got that key. So there's actually an elevator right here. And there's actually a bonfire over here. And we're going to go ahead and kill this knight that's over here at the chance of getting a good weapon. We'll see what he gives me. Ow. Dang it. doing well. What I'm supposed to do is knock him off this ledge. He's gonna kill me. He is gonna kill me. Is he locked to that area? He's locked to that area. Perfect. Let's, uh, let's rest. Let's try this again. And we'll try this again on the next episode. So, uh, thanks for watching, and we will continue playing Dark Souls on the next episode.